Okay, it is currently 12.48 a.m. I waited a little late to get started, but I wanted to test out the new uh, iOS 5 for the iPad and uh, up had to update my Apple TV. I wanted to test out the uh, mirroring um, to see how that would go if I could do it uh, with Huddle on my iPad. So I had to wait a little while to update my iPad, but anyway, let's, uh, let's give it a test, see how this works. All right, so to enable mirroring, um, you're supposed to double tap the home screen. It's going to bring up these options down here. Going to hit this button. And as you can see, you want to hit Apple TV, mirroring on, and voila. All right. Um, you can tell right now I'm dragging back and forth. It's not uh, exactly... Um, perfect but it's not bad and you can see also that I mean no wires so uh, it's a pretty cool feature um, if I tap my huddle icon there's a practice from today let's see how it plays let's pull up a little uh, let's pull up some footage let's see what we got here All right, here's a game that I've pulled up. Um, fiddle load. Uh-oh, there's an error load in the video. Try the next one. Let's see if I've got something on my, that I've downloaded. Um, tick, tick, tick. Well, that's not good. There's an error loading all these videos. Let's see if we can stream one. Let's pull up my dad's. All right, here we go. Let's pull up a um, let's pull up a game from last year. It's trying to stream it, and there it is. All right, let's go full screen. Voila! Now watch it. This is my exact screen. As you can see here to here, no wires. And it is playing. Let's say I want to go to the next play. Whoop, drag it, and there it goes. There's my data. Um, play it. You can see my scrub bar at the bottom. All right, I can fast forward. Whatever I want. The only thing I would suggest, um, which it would have to come from the developer end from Huddle, is that uh, possibly um, right now, I don't know if you can really see it, but it's not full screen on the TV. It's just uh, as it would be on the iPad. Um, but still it's not bad the video itself looks fairly clear it, it's definitely uh, you could use it you can even pause it zoom in if you want to zoom out um, hit play or back to watching it um, use my scr scrubbing buttons one of the things that I would think would be a pretty cool um, suggestion that Huddle could possibly do is which some apps have already done is once you throw out your full screen to the Apple TV is to um, on your iPad just have like a full-fledged control maybe a um, maybe a, a, a scr scrubbing wheel so you could just turn your hand to rewind fast forward and just more of a full screen thing instead of having these smaller buttons right here that you gotta hit so you could just really walk around with your iPad and turn it and be more comfortable than trying to hit these little bitty buttons down here. So anyway, just my thoughts, but I wanted to stay up, see that. Um, I'm definitely uh, impressed with the ability of this. As you can see, I'm, I'm now streaming onto my TV wirelessly. Um, and it's playing pretty dang, pretty dang uh, good. Uh, you'll see here, we get on offense. I'll show you how smooth the video is in playback. You can see you got the overlays up top. Um, and this is obviously a slow mo, just like the old cowboy clicker everybody loves. Um, but that's not bad playing back on the TV. Uh, so overall, I'm pretty impressed. Uh, once again, Huddle is is awesome. I know they didn't really have much to do with this one, but they could play on it a little bit and, and make it even better. Um, but anyway, this is a little iOS 5 and and Huddle via Apple TV. It's a pretty sweet feature.